Let's talk about credit cards for bad credits. And I'm going to talk to you about 12 cards that will not deny you. You get a quick approval, but you got to stick till the end of today's show to find out more. Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sweetie Kiwi Show. How are you doing today? I hope you are doing fantastic. You know what? I'm doing marvelous. If you are doing as great as I am, go grab a cup of coffee or tea or vodka and let's roll. Today, I want to talk to you about credit cards for bad credit and 12 types of credit cards for bad credit that will not deny you. You'll get a quick approval. First, I'm going to talk about six. I'm going to give you six best unsecured credit cards that will not deny you. First up, Credit One Bank Unsecured Visa for Rebuilding Credit. You can see on the screen here. And basically, this is a card that's great. The application length is very fast. In eight minutes, eight to 10 minutes, you get approved or you get a decision. I just put it that way. The interest rate ranges from 18% um, to 24%. They will report monthly to the credit bureaus. And the great thing here is that they have, this credit card has a reputation score of nine over 10. Great thing is that the credit limits ranges from 300 to 3000 based on your credit history. The accounts are automatically reviewed for credit line increase opportunities. You can choose your monthly payment due dates for added convenience. And the great thing here is that you can also manage your account on the go with a Credit One Bank mobile app. The great thing, another great thing here is that you have a 0% fraud liability so that you're never responsible for unauthorized charges. This card allows you to track your, uh, your, your spending gives you send you reminders about payment payment so that you are really 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 on the right path to rebuilding or building your credit so credit one provides its card holders free score tracking and cashback rewards with select card offers it also allows you the card also allows you allows you to pay to choose your payment due date so you can coordinate payments with your own pay schedule number two total visa card now, this is a card that is kind of great. We love it because uh, the application length is really fast. Again, less than 10 minutes. Interest rate varies. They report monthly to the bureaus also, and they have an 8.5 over 10 reputation score. The great thing here is that this card requires a checking account. So you got to link a checking account to, to, to this card. It's um, the uh, this is a genuine Visa credit card that is accepted by merchants nationwide across the United States and online. They give you some kind of a manageable monthly payments, very low. I think it's about five percent of the of the balance, and uh, they give you a three hundred credit limit subject to available credit. Now, the the three hundred they will um, they will increase that limit very quickly. So for the after two or three months that you have been uh, great at paying your uh, your balances, they will review your account and possibly increase you. Number three, Finger Hut credit account. This is a credit card that we love. It has an easy application process. You get a credit decision within seconds. You can use this card to uh, build your credit history. They will report to the three major credit bureaus, uh, Equifax, Experian, and uh, TransUnion. You can use your line of credit to shop thousands of items from, from great brands like Samsung, KitchenAid, and DeWalt. What they do is that they actually have um, they have uh, partnerships with those brands. Now, this is not an access card, folks, so I just want to clarify that. In terms of a reputation score, they have a 9 over 10, and this is great. This is a this is a web, this is a, a, a card that not only allows you to to rebuild or build your credit your credit it also allows you to to track your payments so you will never behind you always know they will send you a they will send you a automatic reminders you they have a great app that you can download and and um, manage your account number four we have milestone mastercard with choice of card image at no extra charge this is the Master MasterCard is kind of cool because you can choose, as I said earlier, as, 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 as I just said, you can choose your image. You can customize the card at no extra, extra charge. You have a chip inserted into the card. You can actually, the, the, the application length is about five, five to 10 minutes. You get a response within seconds. The only thing that we didn't like, even though this card is great, they have a high rec reputation score. 
the average interest rate is kind of high but again it comes with the territory it, it's 25 percent but it, it it makes sense because if you have bad credit then the risk is high so the the apr will go up with this card the you are able you are able to access your account on a 27 24 7 rather 24 7 basis your information is always accessible even on, on mobile your account history is reported every month to the three major credit bureaus in the united states and uh, another thing as i said earlier that this you can pre-qualify for a card and it will not impact your credit score what they do is they have they can go with a soft query a soft inquiry rather a soft inquiry on your uh, on your credit history or a hard one it depends on uh, your situation and how you applied for the you applied for the card in the first place one thing that you have to also understand is that the milestone mastercard credit card allows you to in some in some states in some areas to build rewards to have mileage points to have rewards to have um yeah it's basically in some cases to even get cash back but they started they started um, rolling that out in certain states but this is something that you have to qualify for next we want to talk about indigo platinum mastercard credit card and this is a card that we uh this is kind of cool too and uh, they will uh they will uh, cater to you if you have bad credit or poor credit the interest rate at the apr is 25 percent and um the, the 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 company says that the indigo platinum mastercard accepts applications from consumers with bad or even no credit and uh, this is um, a card that is offered by the celtic bank of utah and it has a low maximum credit limit and it charges an annual fee great thing here is that you have an easy pre-qualification process with fast response this is an unsecured credit card so there is no security deposit required account history of course is reported to the major credit bureaus in the united states and uh, there is an um, th there is an online servicing available 24 7 at no additional cost next we have the first access visa card you can see on the screen right now here we have uh, the reputation score of this card is 8.0 and it, it's it's kind of cool they also report to the credit bureaus every every month and um the application length is 10 minutes to ask you a couple of questions about your job about your uh, your financial situation and so on and so forth and uh interest rates really really varies from 20 percent to 30 percent the for this card though for the first access visa card you need to have a checking account so you want to link that checking account to the card they want to make sure that you are a little bit integrated quote unquote integrated in the in the economy if you will and um perfect credit is not required for approval the the bank the card issuer may approve you when others won't that's what they say that's what they're saying and they have an easy and secure online application the limit though is a little low but it's okay it's a 300 dollars credit limits subject to available credit and uh the first access visa card is issued by the bank of missouri pursuant to a license from visa united States, visa visa usa incorporated so the bottom line here is that uh, this is a card for for you if you are let's say you you have poor credit you're young you're a student or you are still uh you you're, you are a young professional and you're just trying to rebuild or build your credit build your credit i'll be right back right after this don't go anywhere Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sweetie Kiwi Show. I hope you are still uh, with us here. And I've given you, we're having a conversation around credit cards for bad credits. And um, I've given you uh, six best unsecured credit cards for bad credits. Unsecured. Now, I'm going to talk to you about six best secured credit cards for bad credits. Secure credit cards require a deposit that's usually equal to the amount of credit you're issued, but your deposit is fully refundable after your balance is paid off or if you close the account. These cards generally offer a more lenient application process and may not require a minimum credit score or a credit history. Let's first talk about the first Progress Platinum Elite MasterCard Secured Credit Card. 
So this is a card that you have it on the screen right now. So this is a card that um, the interest rate is 20 not is 20 percent. They report monthly. The reputation score is about seven and a half over ten. The great thing here is that no credit history or minimum credit score required for approval. You have a quick and and a complete online application. This is a full feature Platinum MasterCard secured credit card, and they are available. The, the, the program is, is available nationwide, although there are four states where the uh, the card is still not available. So they are available in 46 states, and they're not available in New York, Iowa, Arizona, and Wisconsin at the moment, at the date of this show. And you can uh, apply in just a few moments, and there will be no negative impact to your credit score. In other words, you'll have a soft inquiry. In, in, in some cases, they, they don't even um, report or record any credit inquiry in your credit bureau file. It really depends upon the upon your situation here. But yeah, that's for the first progress Platinum L8 MasterCard secured credit card. We move on to the next. You have the first progress Platinum Prestige MasterCard secured credit card. So uh, this one is kind of similar. The only difference is that the interest rate is way lower. So in the first one, the interest rate was 19.99%. Uh, Here, the interest rate is 9.99%. And uh, the application length is about eight minutes. Then you, you're able to use this card in, uh, in a lot of places. You have a credit line secured by your fully refundable deposit of 2000 to two sorry 200 to two thousand dollars submitted with the application and nation one program again though though not yet available in four states new york iowa arizona and wisconsin as i said and um, they will report monthly to the credit bureaus so that's pretty cool no credit history or minimum credit score required for approval and you can invest your tax refund to improve your credit by making the refundable deposit for your new secured card today that's the, that's the tagline so what they do is they are actually encouraging taxpayers to t take their tax refund and open their credit card the secured credit card with uh, this card issuer next you have the the, the discover it secured the, the, the discovery secured card comes with no annual fee and a competitive APR while still offering bonus rewards for gas and restaurant purchases. Besides, approved applicants can enjoy an introductory balance transfer of providing 10.99% on qualify, qualifying transferred balances plus for six months. So for the, the Discovery credit card, the secured card, you are able to earn 2% cash back on up to one thousand dollars in combined gas and grocery purchases every year that's wonderful folks think about it the minimum deposit amount required to open a discovery secured card is two hundred dollars and the size of your deposit will determine your credit limit your maximum credit limit will be set by discover based on your income and ability to pay but will not exceed twenty five hundred next you have a capital one secured mastercard so this is another one we love. We, we love it. It's great. We've tested it. The Capital One Secured MasterCard is uh, another good no annual fee option for building credit. What's even better, this card has a variable minimum down payment that depends on your individual credit risk. Meaning, if you are a well-qualified applicant, you may only be required to put down 49 bucks for a 200 credit line. So the so for this card, what what's happening here is that you get an initial 200 credit line after making a security deposit of 49 bucks, 99 bucks, or 200, determined based on your credit worthiness. And the Capital One Secured Mastercard will report to all three major credit bureaus. With this card, the great thing here is that you have you pay no annual fee. The interest rate, the APR, ranges from. Um, 10% to 20%. It really depends on your credit worthiness. And, uh, and Capital One is even saying that cardholders who make their first five payments on time may be eligible for a credit line increase with no additional deposit. This card is also upgradable. So cardholders who show responsible credit use may be automatically upgraded to an unsecured card. So it's all about the, the usage, the card usage. 
Next, I want to talk about CD Secured MasterCard. So this is a card that may not have a lot of bells and whistles, but guess what? It offers a low minimum deposit requirement and charges no annual fee. So card holders also get desktop and mobile online banking access to manage their account from anywhere. So you basically have to provide a security deposit of $200 up to $2,500 for a credit line equal to your deposit. And with this card, you can enjoy 24-7 online account access. You pay no annual fee. Now, th this card, though, doesn't have uh, the lowest APR around, but it does offer a grace period on new purchases that allows users to avoid paying interest when they pay their balance in full each month. So it's all about getting to the, the habit of paying your balance in full each month. And uh, last but not the least here, US Bank Secured Visa card. So the minimum deposit amount for this card is uh, $300, $300. And the size of your credit line will be equal to the size of the deposit. And while this card has a small annual fee, it allows users to put down a security deposit up to $5,000 for a fairly high credit line. So you provided your deposit security the de security deposit of uh, 300 to 5000 for a credit line equal to your your deposit i already said that so the deposit earns interest in a secured savings account that's that's fantastic that's great this one is great of course you have to pay 29 bucks annual fee for that and the card has uh, several user benefits that include online banking access automatic bill pay features and zero dollar fraud liability for unauthorized card purchases. So that's, that's just pretty cool, that's pretty cool. Now, before I end today's conversation here, folks, word, word of mouth, not a word of mouth, I would say a pro tip. This, just think of, it, think of this as pro tip, as a pro tip. Do not apply, never apply for cars you're not qualified for. This is why I took the time to go through all the cars here to, um, to explain to you which how the process goes and what the, the fees are but before you apply for any car please read the terms and it's very important because if you apply for the best rewards and cashback credit cards and you are denied which is uh, probably if you have bad credit the hard inquiry can further hurt your score so only apply for the cars that are within your reach and as time goes on and your credit improves you can then go after the cards with lower interest rates and the most benefits to its customers. In the meantime, these cards can be your, your gateway to improved credit and all the benefits that come along with it. All right? Good luck on your journey, and uh, I will see you next time. I want to thank you for uh, sticking around and, and uh, enjoying this conversation with me, and I will see you next time. And before then, remember, stay marvelous.